Okay, here we go. Let's try Pelennor Fields again for the eleventh time. Okay. I'm starting to think this deck can't do it. I just can't get up to speed fast enough. Uh, I, I can't. Hold on. I can't remember if I shuffled. Shuffled. There we go. Um. As much as I like seeing faint. As much as I like seeing these three tactics cards, so I guess I should do a little setup. Uh, so she's Gondor, he's Rohan. Um, five resources per the Siege of Gondor to get Aragorn into play. Yeah, okay. Mm. Might be able to find Steward. I'll tell you what I do like is I don't have a lot of allies, which means I might pull an ally with the next quest stage so let's see I really need steward though okay I don't mind seeing that I can dig for steward I mean I can act for, absolutely find it come on yes okay that's good so I will not be um spending those resources because I need them Okay, I am going to move that there to put him into play. I'm not playing Entmoot, to be honest, because I want, well, if I did, uh, if I grab it, okay, I will, because I want to find a, hopefully a two cost Ent. Uh, wow. I would have discarded all those cards Let's do it again. Not terrible, I guess. Not great either. Okay, um Okay, we advanced the round. So I place a progress here and do a control N, get our free turn. Uh yeah, okay. Very interesting, but stupid. Um, so obviously that goes there. I need to get my defender out. Yeah, I need to have a ready defender. Wow, no lore cards, that's crazy. It sucks, to be honest. Oh man, the other choice is doing this combo so I can trigger Foe Hammer and draw a bunch of cards. Oh, I think that's smarter. And just hoping, hoping I kill something for five. Nope, nope, going back. That, that's not even the right card. Gotta get a defender on the board. Okay. Uh, okay, so we advance. We add the Wraith on Wraith on Wings. We reveal a card. Surges. Great. When revealed, uh, I don't have an Orc enemy in the discard pile, so that's cool though to reveal a bunch of enemies right off the bat. Now I'm wishing I did the the weapon thing. Okay, uh, I discard cards until an ally. Wandering Ent. There is no way I can save this thing. I can't kill all these things. Um, and quest for enough? It's ridiculous. I reveal the one enemy that takes five to kill. <laughs> Unfreaking real. All right. I need to. I'll just quest for four. Oh, this goes here. Whoopsie. That goes there. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I under quest by three. I had no chance. Um, I will 
engage this one. Denethor defends, takes a damage from a plus two. Haldir attacks for three and kills it. Actually, wait, why did I do that? Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I forgot the booming end was ready. So he would have taken, all right, and then I could have killed it. I get that threat out of the staging area. Okay, um, takes two damage, one for each enemy. Nice, okay. Okay, well. Can definitely afford it. I will play the Hawbrick on him. Boost him up a little bit. I will place a weapon on Haldir. Yeah, okay. Okay, that goes there. That goes there. Questing again for very little. Six, because she gets plus one because of questing with a Gondor character. All right, I find an enemy and put it in play engaged with me. I'm going to grab that same one I just killed. This one. I hate that one revealed. I added no threat. I quested for six. One, two, three, four, five. Wow, I can't believe it. Six. Um. So he's going to die. There's absolutely nothing I can do about it. Let's see. Because my plan was to do hands upon the bow. Well, wait. I could still do hands upon the bow. Kill him. No, I don't. I don't have any tactics resources. Never mind. I can't do any of my tactic stuff. All right. I'll just let those all that stay up there. I guess. He's going to attack the Duradinga warrior who's defending for three against three. Nothing. Um, these two together easily kill him. Foe hammer. One, two, three. Okay. I like all those cards. End of the round. He dies. We advance. Okay, so I would take control of each ally I, I owned if, in the staging area. But since I don't, I don't have to do that. Now I'm going to add a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. All right. All right, let's see. Scoot. Minas Tirith gets added. It says uh, 30 hit points plus 10 for each player. At the end of the round, I deal one damage for each enemy in the staging area. If it has no hit points, I lose. I add... Oh, man. I add... Um, the Witch King, six threat, ridiculous. Um, he is going to add an enemy every round. Grand, 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 Grand. Um, he does a damage at the beginning of the quest phase for X, where X is the number of resources. Um, every round I put a resource on him. To travel to him, I have to get attacked by the Witch King. Yeah. It's pretty crazy. Uh, okay. Okay, so now we're doing Assault, which is basically anytime I underquest, the difference in threat versus willpower is damage to Minas Tirith. I have to make eight progress, but I can't place progress 
um, the normal way. I can only place progress by killing enemies. I can, however, place progress on locations. So that was the end of the round. So this end of the round trigger doesn't happen because it wasn't in play at the end of the round. Uh, yeah, I think I control N. Advance the round. Okay. Let's see here. What is going? Oh, there it is. Okay. Now I hid steward. Okay. The steward. One, two. I drew a warden. That's pretty good. I'm happy to see that. I'm going to exhaust the warden right now and heal. I will play Treebeard for four. Four, and then I'm going to ready the warden. Okay, that makes me feel better. Um, pass this resource over here. I'm not going to play the Durndingle. Going to see if I can't do some tactics trickery. All right, so a lot of stuff happens now. I remove a resource from here. I add a resource here and here. They both get a threat for the respective resources. For every resource I do a damage right there. I discard cards until I get an enemy. Nope. I hate that card so thank you. Okay there's my enemy. I also it's annoying that you're constantly re like your staging area gets so compact almost instantly that yeah okay like a so okay okay now I actually quest well I can tell you right now I don't think I'm making any progress I'll quest for one Eowyn gets a boost because he's Gondor because of this so that's six Seven, eight, nine. All right, I'll quest for nine. I'm going to plan on doing hands upon the bow. What is this? Um, deal one damage to each exhausted character or five to Minas Tirith. Uh, I can do damage. One, two, three, four. That's fine. Okay. Boy, I'm glad I triggered that warden. Oh, I could have just done damage. Okay, I was going to say, I thought I just lost, I would have lost Denethor if I hadn't done that. But, yeah. I think I, yeah, okay. I knew there was that deal one damage thing, but I forgot it had a alternate universe, or not alternate, um, you could choose. All right, hands upon the bow for Haldir. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Six is the magic number. Okay, when you kill an enemy, you place progress on this stage equal to the enemy's threat. Progress must be placed on the active first. Okay. So, what do we got? Yeah, I hate how crammed everything gets in here. I'm just going to be doing this all game. 6, 7, 10, 12... 13 to my 9 is 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Alright. Um, I can't travel here. <sighs> 29 threat. Um, so if I engage this guy. Durndingle defends. Booming Ent kills. That gets rid of that. Can I kill this thing yet? That's what I really want to know. So I faint. One, two, three, four. So he's attacking for four, five. 
Shiva ready for 10. That's 15. No, I'm one short. Oh, oh, he doesn't have an attack. I'm one short. Really? I need another damage. I need to damage an Ent somehow. Is there any archery? I'm kind of hoping <laughs> there is no archery. Ah, uh, crap. Are you kidding? Ah, oh, man. One, two, three. Four, five, plus ten, fifteen. Ah, oh, leaf wrapped Lembus, but that seems like a waste. I don't want to have to deal with. Well, I mean, he can. He can handle the attack. He can handle it. I'm so close. All right. I think I got to go one more round because I only want to deal with that guy for one round. So I'm going to engage this guy. Dern Dingle defends. Uh, if Minas Tirith's in play, engage Mordor Oak, Orc and deal it a shadow card. Well, that kind of sucks. Okay. Uh, Durdingle takes no damage on that one. Um, so undefended attacks from him go against Minas Tirith. I could defend the Booming Ent, but I'd really like to get rid of this location. So I'm not going to do that. Discard a non-objective attachment. All right, I will discard old bogey stories. All right, um, okay, he attacks for four. Dead. Uh, I did undefended, right, on that one? Yeah, so I need to do two, two damage. Okay, uh, Booming Ant killed that one, places one progress, so I get rid of the active location, thank you very much. A warden will do some healing. End of the round, I deal damage equal to enemies, so that's two. And we advance the round. Come on, there we go. That's nice. That's nice. I like seeing that. All right. Let's think for a second here. Um... Leaf wrapped Lembus. That's definitely going on somebody. All right. I think I'm going to put him into play like that. I putting a halberd on him makes no sense because he can't ready anyway. So I'll just scoot that over. So now I have both of my events. Huh. I could I could maybe do hands upon the bow against whatever enemy comes up. And then ready Haldir to attack again. So I think I'll do that. Okay, so beginning of the round, all this stuff happens. So this goes away. Boop. You get one. You get one. You go up by one. You go up by one. Gran does two damage. I discard cards until an enemy. Okay, there's my enemy. Can I kill it with hands upon the bow? Yes, I can. Okay, nice. That's actually pretty good. That's actually really good. All right, let's quest. So I want to be able to kill this thing. So I need to muster up 16 attack. 10, assuming he attacks again, he'll be attacking with a Rohan character, so he gets plus one, so that'd be 10, four, five, that's 15 right there. So I just need one more attack, or one more 
You know what I mean. So the booming ent will be able to do it. Okay, awesome. I almost don't need to faint. He can handle that. He's defending for five, six. Six against six. All right. Oh, uh, yeah, we need to quest though. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that boosts her. So now 11. And we reveal uh, Surge. That sucks. Ugh, Surge. Oh, man. Um, attached to a Nazgul. I'm going to attach it to this one. I don't want him to get boosted. So that adds whoops, one of everything. And it surges. Wow, that was a lot of threat. All right, 11, seven, eight, nine, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. I'm gonna do hands upon the bow and kill this one. That's two progress. So that makes it 19. I believe I'll count again because it's a lot 7, 8, 9, 13, 14, 15, 16, 19 okay uh, I lost by 8 there we go um, travel oh you know what Actually, I could travel to Grand. I travel to Grand. I have this attack. He defends. I faint this attack. Ah, that's what I'm going to do. All right, let's try that. So travel. Uh, the effect says Witch King makes an immediate attack. He's attacking for seven because of this thing. I exhaust, I deal a damage, he's defending for six against seven. Please don't boost, please don't boost. Um, discard a non-objective attachment. Okay, I will discard leaf wrapped limbus. Okay, that's that's good. Then uh, I might just have to take that one undefended. I just, you know what, you need to kind of <laughs> literally pick your battles in this case because I'm trying to, yeah, it's more important to get these things that constantly damage Minas Tirith. So, okay, so faint happens. He's not immune, is he? Uh, no. Okay, so faint. Maybe I should have attached... Well, too late now. Might have made more sense. Cause, oh, he attacked for seven, so he actually took a second damage. Um, I guess I was thinking I might not be able to kill this guy. It would take 17, 5, 15. Crap. Crap. Ah, uh, yeah, I probably should have put it on this guy. I was thinking I, I wouldn't be able to kill him. That's right. All right, so I'm fainting him. Okay, goodbye, Burden. I'm taking this one undefended. Okay, awesome. So that's two damage. Okay, so now, raise my threat by three. One, two, three. Ready, Eowyn. Discard Leaf Wrapped Limbus. All right, so 10, 15, 20. Okay. Let's 
to do some healing. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Okay, this is a good turn because now uh, Aragorn is going to come into play. Another weapon. Not going to say no to that. Uh, the Halberk. Need to, I need to give some resources. Oh. One second, everybody. All right, so I played all my cards. Okay, beginning of the quest phase. So that goes away. Aragorn comes in and he has some toys. He has Andril and the banner. They're both artifacts. I think this is an artifact, yep. So he does not exhaust a quest and everybody else gets a little better at questing. So pretty awesome. Put in the total willpower, makes it so much easier. Okay. Uh, beginning of the quest phase, what else do I gotta do? Uh, I put a resource here, which gives him a threat, which isn't as big of a deal, but I still have to do the damage. One, two, three. Um, oh, Witch King. Okay, right. I'm like, what am I forgetting? Nope. Nope. Oh, a Moomac. Blech. Okay, that's no fun. Haven't seen one of those yet. Alrighty. Oh, when I killed that, that Wraith on Wings, he, uh... That was four. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot that Wraith on Wings cleared uh, Grand for me. I forgot about that. Okay, so hold the phone. That goes away. I, I get rid of, this is good. Yeah, okay. Jeez, Chad, don't forget about the whole purpose of how you put progress on. All right. Uh, great. Uh, Aragorn, you are more than meets the eye here. Okay. So he's questing for three, six, ten, these two together are eight because she gets boosted so 18 18 again seven nine ten thirteen seventeen oh man if i exhaust the well hmm, i could exhaust the warden and then i have archery two i could exhaust the warden and ready it i have lots of resources I think I need I need to quest for as much as possible. So I don't want to lose the warden. There we go. Um You know, actually I'm gonna be able to defend that guy. Okay, here we go. Uh what's this? Either deal one damage each exhausted character, haha, -ha! or deal five. Alright. Yes, Abigail. You're not scared. Oh, shoot. Wait, 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 wait. I needed to have engaged that guy. Oh, wait, no. Or did I? I added three for AON plus one. I might have been at 30. Yeah, go ahead, Abby. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Should I have had to engage that guy? Crap. You kind of, 
after a while you, you kind of forget your your normal stuff when did that thing get added I think it got added it got yeah it got added and then I surged into the wraith on wings okay wait hold on I can um I can fix this that was in the staging area this was here this was here right hold on oh my gosh my daughter Add Shadow of Mordor, adds Pelennor Field, and Mumak. So Mumak. Which one was first? Sorry, everybody. Backing up. Actually, I know what I'm going to do. So he would have actually been engaged with me. And he would have got the next shadow. And that would have been undefended. Okay. So that would have been, I think I'm doing this right. But then one less because he wasn't in the staging area at the end of the round. Okay, so now everything else is the same. Still questing everywhere. Grand went away when I killed the Wraith on Wings. Yeah, okay, that, that fixes it. I mean, I just had to put all the cards back on the encounter deck and engage this guy. God, I hate making mistakes like that, but it's so easy to do when you're sitting here trying to like figure out your strategy and you just forget to check stuff like that. Okay, so yeah, okay, that, that solved all that problem. That solved all that problem. I did all the damage. Okay, we're good to go. So, still it's 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 16. Oh yeah, because he's not there. Okay, so again, it doesn't matter. Alrighty, um, combat. Combat. If I don't engage, I don't have to deal with his attack. That seems like a smart idea, so I won't engage. Uh, I'm going to exhaust the warden and heal. Heal. And then I have two archery, which I'm fine with. I gotta start healing off some other characters I guess one there all right he's defending for three against two nothing same thing three against two. Oh, thank you goodbye nothing okay let's damage stuff so Haldir is attacking for basically seven so that does the three booming ants attacking for a lot that places a progress. Aragorn's attacking for four. That places a progress. Control N, the Welling Hall Preserver will heal. Oh, of course you draw. Well, I didn't kill anybody with a weapon. I'll heal there. Okay, so Seward of Gondor is going to ready the Warden. So one of the Wardens, so I exhaust the Warden heal heal and then I ready the warden yeah okay so steward of Gondor basically readied the warden okay uh, resource that's good questing so beginning of the round no more 
Oh, I always forget this. Two damage at the end of the round. I could have traveled here. I'm actually okay at the moment. I should have traveled there. Why didn't I? Guys, I'm going to back up just a hair. I wanted to travel there, and I just I got distracted by a phone call I had to take. Since I'm recording this, I, I do a little editing. I edit out like long breaks, like that phone call, or when my daughter needs juice. Um, so that kind of threw me off. I was going to travel there and then do combat. Okay, so then... Since I traveled there, at the end of the round, the damage would have went there. Because the city wall says... Damage that would be placed on Minas Tirith is placed there first. So, Grand, um, Minas Tirith's own effect from these two enemies goes here. Okay. Questing. Oops, he doesn't exhaust. One, two, three, six, ten. Ah, oh, shoot. I gotta do the enemy thing. Okay, there we go. So much to keep track of. Ten. I'm going to cross with both of these guys, so that's 8 more, so 18, because she's 6, plus 1, 7, 8, 8 plus, yeah, 18, okay, 18, what am I up against, 2, 6, 8, 8 plus 7, 15, this is gone, I don't need this anymore. 8 plus 7 is 15. Uh, that's pretty good. I could quest with the Warden and ready him. I think I'm okay. When revealed, remove a hero you control from the quest and attach Black Dart to that hero. Yuck. Limit 1 per hero counts as a condition attachment. Forced at the end of the round, deal a damage to the hero. Okay, uh, remove a hero from the quest. So that'll be Denethor. That's going to drop my questing by four. Because she's no longer questing with a Gondor hero. He was questing for two. Oh, it drops my, threat. It drops my questing by three. Oh, so it's even. Oh, perfect. Okay, uh, I'm okay with that. Um... I wish I didn't have to engage this guy, but there's nothing I can do about it. So I think I will engage the Mumak and this guy. Turns off Haldir. All right, let's think here. When he's dealt a shadow card of no effect, Either deal three damage or he makes an additional attack. Alrighty. Um, God, that could go over and over and over again, couldn't it? If I, well, if you did additional attack. Okay, he's attacking for four. Durdingle is currently defending for three. There is no shadow, but I'm glad to see that thing go away. So I'll deal a damage. I will do three damage here. I don't want to have a bunch of attacks from this guy. He's attacking for six. I'm gonna heal him up. And uh, let me think here. And tree beard, I guess. So he's defending for six. One plus three plus two. Oh, I didn't do archery two. I gotta do the archery. Okay, so then one of those would have been healed there. And there, I guess. I forgot the archery. Either deal three damage, or he makes an additional attack. That's the same effect! That's lazy writing! Alright, three damage. Uh, so that was six against six. Okay, very good. I want Haldir to kill this guy, so he's one, two, three, four, five, plus Aragorn, kills this guy, 
which lets me trigger faux hammer. One, two, three. Okay, he was how much? He was two. Oh, that kind of sucks. Oh wait, ha! -ha! Wait, 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 wait! Some of that damage would have went here. It doesn't matter which. I mean, two of that damage would have went here first, and then that went away. My threat goes up by three. One, two, three. So the two progress does go there. Nice. Okay, and then booming ant is attacking for one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Uh, that's enough to do the three. There's just so many things to keep track of in this quest. Oh, okay. Um, then what does this thing do now? Now I have one more thing to remember. At the end of the round, I deal a damage. Okay. At the end of the round, I deal a damage. Okay. Advance. Dwelling Hall Preserver will heal one of these guys. One, two, one. I am happy to see another Warden. That will spend two. I'm going to do some healing. There we go. I'm going to ready him up. And draft. We'll go right here. Okay, very good. Um, beginning of the quest phase. We discard cards until an enemy. Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay, there's my enemy. Uh, okay, time to quest. So one, two, three, four, five, six, ten. Uh, Fifteen. Fifteen seems fine. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. Okay, fifteen. Uh, another enemy when revealed either deal two damage to a hero or two damage to minister I will do two damage to a hero because I can heal it I need a hero all right um I quest successfully so no progress goes anywhere uh now it's combat So he's at 40. That's getting scary. I gotta remember that. Okay, so I'm at 39. So he engages. He can stay there. I got archery 3 to deal with. So I think I'll go 1. Uh, 2. 3. I'm gonna heal off some of it. 1. Two, one, two. Okay, there we go. Okay, uh, I'm going to at defend of Aragorn three against two. If Minas Tirith in play, engage this orc and deal it a shadow card. But, oh, there's no cards left in the encounter deck. Ha, huh, that's cool. Andriel gets to trigger. I get to attack for four immediately after I defend to kill this guy. And that is one. I advance, guys. I advance. Horns, horns, horns. In the dark Mildonian side, they dimly echoed. Great horns of the north wildly blowing. Set the Witch King aside out of play. Gladly. Get the hell out of here. Um, search the top 10 cards of my deck for an ally that matches 
Quick beam. Yes. I will take quick beam. Uh, I'm just going to exhaust him instead of putting the damage on him. Okay, the horns of Mor oh the hosts of Mordor wailed and terror took them and they fled and died and the hosts the hooves of wrath rode over them. Okay, so then during the next quest stage I'm going to have to uh deal with all this, but he gets a shadow card. Oh there is none. That's why I didn't do that. Okay, so I know Denethor can defend that, no problem. Then this Durdingle is going to go against him. Deal a damage to him. We're good there. All right. Haldir attacks for five. Does the three damage that's needed. And I reduce my threat by four. One, two, three, four. Thank you. I kill this guy too. Nice. Okay, great. Uh, I believe that's a control N. That's advancing the round. At the end of the round, I'm going to do a damage here and a damage there. Welling Hall Preserver, yes. So two of Steward's resources and one of Haldir's. Treebeard gets a resource. The Welling Hall Preserver that readied would have healed this guy, let's say. Um, I don't want to lose my Wardens. Okay, I think we're good to go. So I no longer have to deal an extra card. I don't even have to make a lot of progress. So maybe I won't quest with a hero in case a Black Dart comes out. Because that is... Yeah, that's, that's no good. Oh, but Aragorn will be committed, so it's fine. Alright. Five. I want Aragorn to be committed. 8, 11, 15. Fifteen against four? That seems good. I'm only I just want to deal damage. The card is a siege tower. Okay, fifteen against seven. So the host of Rohan kill this guy for me. Thank you, Rohan. I advanced to stage five. And now the fighting waxed furious in the fields of the Pelennor and the din of the of arms rose upon high with the crying of men and the neighing of horses. So I add the Witch King this side. And then I attach it a fell beast to the Witch King if able, but I can't, already, it's already there. Uh, and I shuffle the encounter deck, and then each other player reveals a card. Witch King and Shadow cards are immune. If I lose a character to an attack, I deal a damage. And I have to kill the Witch King to win. Okay, so I'm currently in combat. So at the beginning of the encounter, or I'm at, I'm at travel. So I'm going to travel here, because this thing is an archery 3 while it's in the staging area. When this becomes the active location, discard the discard or shuffle the discard pile into the encounter deck and discard cards until I find an enemy. Or do I just take archery three? I have so much healing. I could I really don't want to find that freaking black serpent or something. Um Archery three. That's not the worst. I'll just keep it there. What about this thing? Well, let's see. If I travel there, then I get an enemy in the staging area. Then I'll have to deal with it. I have two attacks coming from this guy, so no, I don't want to do that. Alright, I will travel to the Pelennor Field thing. All right, during the encounter step, he engages me and makes an immediate attack, which I'll be defending with this. Uh, before I defend, I'm going to heal. Whoops. 
Oops, wrong button. I'm going to heal, oh my gosh, him and Denethor. Okay, here's the attack. Uh, okay, that's fine. So he was attacking for seven. I deal a damage. So he's defending for six, and he takes an additional hit. Okay, now combat. This Dern Dingle Warrior is going to defend. Either deal three damage, or this guy makes another attack. It looks like three damage. One, two, three. Uh, he basically takes two damage. One to boost him. One for the damage that sneaks through. All right, let's try to kill this jerk. So Treebeard can ready. What do I got? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Fourteen. Seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. I forgot to do archery. 25, 26, 27. You're dead, you jerk. All right. That's cool. Okay, Warden of Healing will heal you and you. End of the round, you take a damage. You know, at this point, if I've missed some weird trigger somewhere or something, I, I don't really care. I feel like, I mean, this quest obviously has not been <laughs> easy. Okay, exhaust, heal, heal. Um, I'm ready. All right, it looks like we're just trying to... Oh, this guy would have been in staging. I forgot about him. So he would have done a damage because I didn't have to engage him. So he would have been in the staging area. He would have done one archery. So let's just put it on Treebeard, I guess. Forgot about him, the guy that snuck through the gate. That's what I mean. Like, just 10,000 things going on. Okay, I don't have any beginning of the quest stage type stuff. Man, I'm going to have to watch this video for Fine Tooth Comb. I hope I've done well. Actually, I had two Welling Hall Preservers ready, didn't I? So he could have healed Treebeard. There, okay. It ended up the same. He just, he healed that archery damage because he was in play. All right, one, two, three, four, seven, ten, thirteen. 17, 21, 24, she's questing with a Gondor, 30, 32, I'm readying both of these guys, okay, 32, Uh, doomed one surge. Each enemy engage if you makes an attack. Okay. Surges into doomed one. Discard an ally you control. Until the end of the phase, add one threat for each ally in your discard pile. Discard an ally I control, huh? Um. I guess I'll discard the booming end. I have I have plenty of attack, so okay. Look at all my allies. One, two. Oh, okay. Two threat. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh man, it's amazing. Oh, what do we got here? That's a difference of twenty-six. Oh my god. <laughs> go 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 go! Put. Progress, more, build it up, too much. Actually, it's perfect. No, uh, whoa, okay, I, uh, back it off, back it off, back it off. Okay, uh, folks, that is a victory. 
I never even uh, had a character destroyed. I'm pretty sure I got it. I'm going to have to watch the video, but I'm pretty sure I got it. Wow, okay, so Wraith on Wings gets added to my campaign pool, and I also get these two boons. Wow, okay, cool. I'm pretty sure the campaign continues, unless there's something crazy. Sorry for missing some of these triggers and everything. It got a lot to keep track of, but pretty sure I fixed that one thing where I should have engaged that Sergi Orc dude. It really was just the first card I discarded to the Witch King anyway, so... Um, yeah, I have eight damage to spare on Minas Tirith. So if I watch the video and realize I missed some damage to Minas Tirith, as long as it's not eight, uh, we pretty much won, I think. So thanks for watching, and 